Marcus Conti reporting, breaking news, breaking news. Jeffrey Epstein bail ruling has been delayed as more accusers come forward. Breaking news, just in about five, ten minutes ago. So New York Post is reporting Jeffrey Epstein will have to cool his heels at least as long, a little longer in jail as Manhattan prosecutors revealed Monday that more alleged victims have already stepped forward since his arrest early this month. Quote, the evidence is already significantly stronger and getting stronger every day, Assistant U.S. Attorney Alex Rosenmiller told Manhattan Federal Court Judge Richard Berman. Judge Richard Berman said, what did Richard Berman say? Epstein, already a convicted pedophile, had hoped the jurist would rule in his favor on his bail request in his latest case Monday. So, long story short, it's, it's good news. He's still in jail, going right back under the tunnel, back into the jail, hold him down. All right? it's, not a, it's not a ruling of remanded, but it's remanded till Thursday. Right? That's the ruling. But Berman said he wanted, before ruling, Berman said, Judge Berman said, he wants to hear from some of Epstein's victims as soon as Monday and have the former hedge fund manager's financials looked over further before deciding on whether to free him till his trial. The judge said he plans to rule on bail Thursday. Federal prosecutors, in arguing that the 66-year-old pervert should stay at the Metropolitan Correctional Center, said they have more of his victims come forward to report uh, crimes since his arrest. So there are just more people coming forward. Rose Miller added that authorities are still investigating the stash of, quote, many, many, many photos of women and girls who appear to be young. That was uh, found in Epstein's Upper East Side Mansion. Hmm. I wonder if they'll ever get to the real stash, right? right? The billionaire stash of compromised videos. Uh, and where are those girls? Right? Where are the girls? You know what's also interesting? Where's the, where's the billionaires complaining that, that Epstein ripped them off? Right? Now all of a sudden Epstein's in jail and, and all their money is tied up in who knows what. Wouldn't you be like, if, you, if it was a legitimate fund and a legitimate um, uh, investment fund with Epstein, wouldn't you, wouldn't you be worried? Wouldn't you uh, make a public statement and say, oh, shit, I got, a, I got, you know, I got $100 million invested with this guy. How's my money doing? Not a word, not a peep, nada, nada, nada. At least one of the female photogra- photo, photographed nude of semi-nude or semi-nude has come forward as a victim. <laughs> whoop de doo Epstein, who was charged with sex trafficking and been accused of abusing and raping underage girls, appeared to listen intently during the proceedings, holding his hand under his chin. He entered court in a navy blue uniform walked quickly to his seat at the defense table. He wore triangular framed reading glasses, and as soon as the proceeding started, began uh, hurried, hurriedly uh, scribbling notes to his lawyer on his left, Martin Weinberger. Martin Weinberger? <laughs> Martin Weinberger, Martin Weinberger, please report to the information desk, Martin Weinberger. Fucking guys. Prosecutors have said he is trying to bribe potential witnesses to keep quiet about his crimes. Rose Miller said prosecutors only learned late last week about $350,000 in payments uh, they say made to potential witnesses. So add witness tampering to the, to the, you know, to the pile. I don't know, man. Mark's County reporting. I'm glad I didn't stay down there and waste my time just hanging around fake news, getting beat on by the sun. Uh, it's fucking hot down there, right? It's standing out in the sun, waiting, waiting, waiting for the worms. So, so hurry up and wait. Uh, Epstein um, is back in back in the clink. Uh, Thursday, I still don't suspect that that they're going to let him out, right? Um, uh, uh, apparently, each side, uh, each side in this case will get. Um, will get 20 minutes to argue their case. So the defense gets to argue uh, 20 minutes as to why Epstein should be let out, and uh, the prosecution gets to get, gets 20 minutes to decide um, if he uh, should stay. And I believe that that's what happened today. I'm not really sure, but I think so. But nonetheless, the judge will, um, the judge will rule 
uh, by Thursday. And that's all we know for now. So uh, it's a good day. I think it's a win. I mean, it's a temporary win. Any victory that keeps the scumbag behind bars is a uh, is a win. Can't complain about that shit, right? You know, you leave him locked up, man. Let him eat some prison food. Every day he gets a little weaker, a little, you know, a little more compromised, a little more willing to to speak. I'll right? say anything to get out of that motherfucking jail, right? Marcus Conte reporting.